What's up everybody, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be doing another upper body Pilates workout. We'll be using light hand weights for this workout. I'm using three pound dumbbells. If you have heavier than that and you wanna go for it, go for it. We're just gonna start off coming into a comfortable seated position. We'll take a couple deep breaths and then we'll get into the fun stuff. So I want you to anchor your sits bones down to the mat. You can go cross-legged, legs out in front of you, whatever you wanna do. Take a big roll of the shoulders backwards and we're gonna focus this breath work into our rib cage today. Big inhale, I want you to think about spreading air from side to side and then from front to back. We'll take a big exhale, let all that air out. Three more like that, nice big inhale. And then we'll exhale out, let it go. Good, two more, big inhale. And then we'll exhale out, let it go. Good, last one, nice big inhale. And we'll exhale out, let it all go. Perfect. From here, we're going to go ahead and pop up into a side kneeling position. You can take your weights with you. We'll start with the left knee down on the mat. Right leg is going to kick out by your side. Before we even do anything, I want you to make sure your hips right on top of your knee. You've got your belly button drawing in towards your spine, your tailbone's tucked under. We'll grab onto both of our weights and we're going to tuck our elbows right into our rib cage. You'll flip your palms up towards the ceiling. From here, we'll exhale to lift the arms up so they come in line with your shoulders. We'll inhale, bend through the elbows, take things right back down. Big exhale, we'll lift. Inhale, we'll lower. Good. Once you feel good right here, if you would like to, the next time you pull the elbows in, you're gonna hinge back from the hips. You'll press the arms up, you come back up into that high kneel. Pull it back, press it up. Totally up to you if you'd like to do that. If you don't want to, I get it. Good, let's do three more like this, three. We'll go two. And then last one, we're gonna press back up into that high kneel. I want you to flip your palms down. We'll inhale, bend the elbows. Exhale, you're gonna extend the elbows, push right back out. Inhale, bend, exhale, press. Good, bend and press. Now again, if you want to, as you bend the elbows, you can hinge back from your hips and then press the hands forward as you come back up into that high kneel. Totally up to you. Three pounds gets heavy really quick. So if you have three pounds and you're like, oh no, what have I committed to? It's, we're just gonna do it together, okay? Three more here, three. We'll go two. And then last one. Good, good, good. We're gonna take everything down right here. We're gonna bring our weights together. So cross your weights together in an X and then clasp your hands together around your weights. Your hands are gonna come right down in front of your left hip. We're gonna take a big inhale to cross our body, lifting the weights up towards the right, and then we'll inhale, take it right back down, okay? A Little bit of rotation in the upper body as we swing up and then lower down. We're just gonna do four more like this, four. Whew, this is three. We'll go two. And last one. Good, take everything down. We're gonna step that right knee in and I'm gonna flip to the side so you can see what we're gonna do right here. Knees are gonna stay about hips distance apart. You're gonna draw your belly button in, hinge back from the hips. So your hips are hovering right over your heels. We're gonna tuck the elbows into our rib cage, flip the palms in towards each other. We'll exhale, extend the elbows, press your hands back. Inhale, bend the elbows, pull forward. Press back, pull forward. We go back and forward, good. Perfect, next time you press your hands back, you're gonna hold right there. I want you to press your hips up so you come up into a high kneel, don't move your arms. Sit your hips back and then bend through the elbows, pull forward, we keep going like that. Press back, hips press up so you're in that high kneel. Hinge back from the hips, bend the elbows. Four more like that, four. <sighs> This is three. Two. And last one. 
Beautiful. Good. From right here, you're going to let your arms go nice and long. All we'll do is exhale, press back. Inhale, pull forward. You'll keep this hinge forward from the hips. However, if that becomes too much, your hips come all the way down to your heels. You'll just keep that little hinge forward. That's fine. You just might not be able to keep your hands right underneath your shoulders. You might have to open them out a little bit in order to get that same range of motion. That's fine with me. <sighs> Can you tell I'm out of breath? <laughs> Good. Let's do four more. Four. We'll go three. two and last one good take everything in sit up nice and tall we're going to move right over to the other side getting back up into that side kneeling position right knee goes down left leg is going to press out by your side take a deep breath you're going to make it through i promise we're going to do this together you've got it under control from right here we're going to tuck those elbows into our sides this time we keep that 90 degree bend we're going to exhale lift those arms up and then inhale squeeze it right back in Lift up, pull in, good, up and in, we'll go up and in. If you want to, as you lift the elbows up, you can hinge back. I'll give you that same option on this side, don't you worry. Whew. Just keep breathing, we're gonna do four more, four, Three, two, and last one. Good, we come all the way up, drop the hands so they come right in front of you. We'll take a big exhale, lift the arms so they come up in line with the shoulders. Inhale, take it right back down. Oh my gosh. <laughs> you guys, I don't know if it's that it's hot in my room because of all the lights on right now, or like if this is just a really hard workout, I think it's the three pound weights. They get me every single time. Lift and lower. Good. If you want to hinge back from the hips as you lift those arms up and then come back up into that high kneel. Good. You've got it under control. You guys are stronger than me. And I know that you are because you consistently do my workouts every day. Some of you. Let's do three more, three, two, and last one. Good, we come all the way up. You're gonna cross your weights, make an X, and then clasp your hands together around your weights. Your weights come right in front of your right hip. Gosh, are you guys gonna make it? I don't know if I'm gonna make it. We're like right at the end, but oh my gosh, big inhale. We're gonna cross our body over towards the left. And then we'll take it right back down. I think I said exhale to lift. Okay, inhale, we're gonna do rotate. Remember, it's not a lot. We're just doing four more. Four. This is three. Two. Last one. Good, take everything down. You get to toss those weights off to the side. That's the good news. You can sit your hips all the way back to your heels. We'll reach the arms out beside us and we're just gonna cross one arm over the other so we can open up through the chest, open up through the backside body as well. It doesn't have to be anything super complicated. Good, let's just do two more each side. Two, two, last one. And one, we'll take a big inhale, reach those arms around and up, grab onto your left wrist with your right hand. Big inhale to find length. And then we're gonna tilt over towards the right side, opening up into the left side body. Good, we're gonna exhale, come up through center, switch out your hands, grabbing onto the right wrist with the left hand, inhaling up, and we're gonna tilt it over towards the left, opening up into that right side body. Ah, big exhale, we'll pull everything up. You drop your arms down. Good work today, you guys. You made it all the way to the end. Remember, you are awesome. You can do anything that you, any, I can't even say it, I'm so tired. You guys are awesome. You can do anything you put your mind to and I will see you in our next video.